So, have you been to Michigan? Uh, I have been to Michigan. Because so. when I heard, like, in the land of women, that was probably, that was probably the visa. last place I was thinking, Michigan. Yeah, yeah. Well, that may be true. Hey, how you doing? Just regrouping. Okay, maybe I was wrong about women in Michigan, but one thing I know is true, there are plenty of women familiar with this guy, Adam Brody. The 27-year-old actor spent the last four years melting millions of teeny bobber hearts on the O.C. Hey, what's going on? I just can't help it. Uh-huh. But when the O.C. was abruptly canceled this February, Adam wasn't too upset. I'm fine with it. I, lo I loved it. I wanted everyone there. Um, but, you know, four years, ten months a year telling one story is, uh, uh, it's a lot. Adam's hoping he can take his success from the show and launch himself into movies. With In the Land of Women, he plays a screenwriter of sorts who winds up taking care of his grandmother in Michigan. In the process, he befriends his neighbor, who was just diagnosed with breast cancer. I must sound so young to you. Yeah, well, screw you, pal. Well, you're like the counselor for women, sort of. Are, yeah. are, are you this guy in real life a little bit? Um, the shoulder, maybe, for, for ladies? I hope so. Uh, I can't recall. I mean, I think, I'm, I think I've got some good advice. I'm a good, I, think I'm, I like to think of myself as a good listener, a good conversationalist. However, uh, I can't recall a time where I uh, helped a group. <laughs> yeah. You're older, intelligent, mysterious. I am mysterious. But there are even more women involved here. Besides the mother, played by Meg Ryan, Adam lights a few sparks, and her daughter was played by Kristen Stewart. Well, now instead of making out with the teenager, you're making out with the moms and the daughters. That's right. Yeah, it's right. a trifecta. <laughs> okay, maybe the shy playboy thing works for the guy, but it's never been easy for stars of primetime soaps to break into movies. Can this guy finally break the Fox slump? 90210, Melrose Place. You don't see a lot of those stars go on and become really successful movie right. stars. That is true, but that was much more true in the 80s and 90s than it is today. I mean, now you go to do a pilot to get a show so you can go do a movie. That's the only reason I'm in this, is because I was on the OC. I mean, otherwise it would not have happened.